All right, you guys, are y'all ready for the quick and easy, the best Italian spaghetti sauce? Mm mm mm. With some good old spaghettis? Oh, yeah. Stay till the end because you'll be able to make the same good old best Italian spaghetti. Also, some good old garlic cheese toast on French sliced bread. Oh, yeah. Good old cheesy goodness baked to a crisp perfection. Oh, yeah. That you just pull apart while you're eating your spaghetti. Oh, yeah. These are the ingredients. Let's get into this cooking video. Oh, yeah. All right, you guys. So these are your ingredients. And I'm gonna go step by step on how to make the best Italian spaghetti sauce, spaghetti meat sauce. Mm -mm. So I've taken that two and a half to three pound of ground beef and have onions that I've already diced up, an onion and a half of a small onion. And you got all the seasoning that you saw. They're all in this fry pan. Now we're just gonna saute everything together with the ground beef. And once everything gets browned, We'll go to the next step. Oh yeah. So as you see, everything's brown. All the onions are sauteed. All the seasonings are all in this ground beef. And as you can see, I have drained the oil and left a little bit in there. Now I'm gonna go ahead and put the spaghetti in the hot waters and we're gonna go ahead and let those come to a boil. And once they're done boiling, we still want them to be a little al dente. So once they're done boiling, we're gonna strain the noodles and we're gonna keep about a cup of, of the um, pasta water. Now we're gonna combine our meat in with our noodles. And we're just gonna mix them around because we wanna get some of that extra fat that we left in um, the beef, we're gonna make sure that's incorporated. Now we got our two sauces here. We got tomato, basil, garlic, and marinara. We're gonna pour both jars in there. And once we get both jars in there, I'm gonna get my spaghetti um, spoon out and we're gonna mix everything up and we're gonna let it simmer. We're gonna let it simmer for about 15 to 20 minutes and as it's simmering, I'm gonna be taking the, uh, my noodle fork, my noodle spoon, and I'm gonna be um, just moving everything around so that all that sauce get all into those noodles. Oh yeah. And all that ground beef get into that sauce. Oh yeah, don't that look good? Mm-hmm. Okay, now everything's been simmering now for about 15 minutes. And as you can see, it's still simmering. Look at that goodness, you guys. I want you guys to try it. If you do, hit me in the comment section below. And subscribe. Subscribe and become a part of the Promo STK family today. Hit that red button and make it turn gray. Because I got a lot more recipes for you. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to get that same Fiesta cheese that we use on our bread, and we're just gonna pour it on top of that sp spaghetti and while it's in the pot. And so when it's ready to come to the table, it'll be all melty and good, oh yeah. Now we're gonna get into this good old Italian garlic cheesy bread, mm, mm, mm. And this is how I make it, you guys. So it's quick and easy, quick and easy, quick and easy. All you need is to have you some French bread or Italian bread. You can have it already sliced or you can slice it yourself. And then you'll need a stick of butter or margarine, one stick, and about one to two tablespoons of minced garlic. Microwave it for about a minute and then take and pour it all over that bread. I used a loaf pan. You can use whatever type of pan you want. Then load it with cheese. I have about two cups of this Fiesta cheese blend 
and I just poured it all on top. Just make sure you press it down. Get that cheese all in that bread. We're gonna bake that in the oven at a preheated oven on 350 degrees for about 15 to 20 minutes. And when it comes out, look at how it looks. Mm -mm -mm. So it's pulled bread. So once you get it to the table, you just take a fork or a knife, just pull it apart with your hands and just serve it. And come meet us at Promo SCK Eating Good in the Neighborhood and watch us mukbang it. Oh yeah.